All right, guys, so this has been a slow couple weeks for me. Just letting you guys know really quick, uh, I haven't had a chance to get out and do much fishing. I don't have the boys as much as I have had in the past, say, even year, year and a half. So dealing with some personal issues, maybe I'll go into a little bit later, but they're not being able to come hang out with me as much and I'm not be able to get them out on the water. That being said, let's announce the winner of the most recent every 100 subscriber giveaway. We just hit 600, thank you guys all so much. We're choosing to organically grow our channel with all you guys and grow with quality subscribers that wanna see our content and wanna watch our videos. So we appreciate all that love. Now, that being said, let's go ahead and pick the most recent winner for 600 subscribers and for the Rios pair of sunglasses, you get to get on the website, pick whatever you want, we ship them right to you from Rios. So thank you for Rios with partnering with us this year. Awesome sunglasses, we love them. And uh, let's get right to it. Let's go to the computer for our random drawing. Here you go, guys. All right, so here we go. We got the drawing going on. You can see it randomly being picked. And the winner is gonna be Catch Fish Not Feelings. There we go. Okay, so there you have it. The winner, Catch Fish Not Feelings. And again, we appreciate that, guys. He comments on all of our videos. And again, the more you comment, the more you have more chances you have to win. All of you who have subscribed, who have watched our videos, thank you so much. Let's get to this video. What's up guys? Happy Saturday, day after we went fishing and now Bo Rooks is gonna help me fillet these fish. So we're gonna fillet these on the back of my truck, on a towel, just so we don't get inside the boy's mom's house and get it all messy and nasty and you know the deal. So we're gonna do these guys first. Here we go, got some striped bass. That guy, he's the big boy, we'll do him last. We'll do smaller ones first and then we'll do the big boy. Okay. First thing we're gonna do is um, get these guys hosed off because they're slimy from being in the ice. Flip them over. Feel them. Does he feel slimy? Does he feel good? Good. All right. Well, I've set them too. All right. Is he good? Yeah. All right. So now we're gonna put them up here. Go ahead and grab them. Where are you going, dancing queen? Get over here. Pick them up. Put them on that towel for me. We're gonna use a towel, guys, just so it doesn't slide around. Okay guys, we're gonna fillet these striped bass up and cook some up tonight and tomorrow night. We got our two Dexters. We got our eight inch and our nine inch. 33 inch, 33 inch or 15 and a half pounds. This is a tough fish. And we're just coming down the side like you normally would any fillet fish. Follow that, follow the rib cage. It can be very daunting filleting one of these big fish, but it's actually easier than filleting a smaller fish. That's it, until you get skin on the other side. There's your fillet. Look at that. We'll all finish up with the other side, guys. And we're gonna see you in the kitchen. So guys, we're filleting up these two fish. Look at the difference between the blue fish. Here, we're just cutting up now. Guys. And rockfish. Rockfish. 
See, big difference, guys, huge difference. Guys, um, wanna, wanna know why bluefish are called bluefish? Why? Because their meat is blue. Their Literally. meat looks blue, doesn't it? Literally looks blue. And their bodies are kind of blue on the outside too, aren't they? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Ooh. Okay guys, so we're doing catch and cook tonight with the rockfish that we got last night. Brooks I am is, the chef. Oh, Brooks is the chef. So we're slicing up some lemons, but the first thing I want to show you guys is we're doing a grilled killer artichoke recipe that we're going to throw on the grill as an appetizer. And then we have a sauce we put with a little mayonnaise as a dipping sauce. So that, this is soy based. So that's what we'll use for an appetizer. Let's go put these on the grill. Go put those on the grill. Hey Gunner, <gasps> do you want artichokes? Do you want artichokes? Blue, yeah. what about you? Do you want artichokes? I don't know. Blue's our 11 year old. He's getting old. Ten. He's 10, almost 11. Gunner's a puppy. Aren't you, buddy? He's only, he's only six months old. Six months old. All right, let's go. This should be on low, I'm hoping. Oh my God, I think it's on high. Let's see, what are these on? You can just take these, pick them up, throw them on here, buddy. Crap. Okay, go ahead. Let's use the tongs. So what we're gonna do with these is I'm gonna throw them on the, we're gonna throw them on the grill a little bit to, we've, we've steamed them. Ooh. You can pour that juice on top of those if you want a little bit. Um, and they're just going to cook. Then we're going to put them on high. Give them a, get, a little, get a little blackness on them. Oh, that's starting 22 minutes. All right, so we got the artichokes on the grill. What we're doing for the fish. This is the rockfish. Some of the rockfish we cut from last night fillets. Just one of the rockfish. We are going to use salt, pepper, Garlic salt. Garlic salt. So and obviously control have... your salt because you have salt in your garlic salt. And then we have Irish, pure Irish butter. All oh. right. What we're gonna do is, and we're gonna have an onion we're slicing up and lemons. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna put a couple, we're gonna put some garlic, salt, some pepper. We're gonna put some pats, uh, oh, I'm sorry, some onion rings cut on here. And then we're gonna put um, lemon. And then we're gonna put pats of butter on each one of those and let this all melt and steam in the grill. And wait till you see this thing come out, how flaky it is. It's gonna be unbelievable. Okay, so we are gonna start with salt and pepper, I'm guessing? Or the garlic. Yeah, we're gonna do salt and pepper. So a little bit of salt, because I like pink Himalayan sea salt. Just a little bit all the way across. Good. Now do your pepper. Chase is watching YouTube. Little more pepper. Can't do too much pepper. There we go. Good. Now a little bit of the garlic salt. Remember, it salt. comes out fast, right? There you go. Keep going. Not too much in one spot. Good. Delish. Okay. Okay. Good. All right. Now we got to cut. Make sure the onions are cut. Okay. So. Here you go. Yep. That guy. That little rock. Mm-hmm. I'm just gonna go get oh, one more, right? Just go get one more. Are you gonna lose small ones? That'll kind of keep your. That's good. That's actually perfect. Keep these on the side. He's gonna slice it that away. Then we gotta take it, slice them in half there. Yep, and put a pat of butter in each one of your choo choo trains. One. <laughs> More. Yeah. More? Throw them one on each end. Let me take it. Throw one right yep, end. Yep, right on the end. Throw one right end. Perfect. Now get your lemons. Now get your lemons. Oh, here you go, right here. Use this one. Perfect. Now sprinkle me a little more pepper on top. And then a little more garlic salt on top. Good, dude. That is looking money. That's all you need for this fresh fish. So I do the boat first. So you got it in the middle. 
like this, both sides. We're gonna leave it like so it's choo-choo. Now curl your sides up. You have to keep the choo-choo in. Hold on. So guys, we've got our fish ready to go on the grill. All right, let's go throw that on the grill too. I mean, I'll get that for I you. I burned buddy. myself before and it didn't even feel good. Now. All right, so all right. Fish is on. Fish is on. They just went on. Um, I was taking my hand off with it, which is awesome. How long are we going to cook these? 20 minutes? Yeah. All right. So our artichokes are looking pretty good over here. We're going to try to turn these up a little bit, char them so we can eat these as an appetizer. Okay, so this is what the artichokes look like when they're done. So you, pull, you pull the I'll leaf off. I'll do one off. with this dish. Pull the leaf off. And you don't tell them what you do. Thing. Rip off the M. Like, put your teeth on it. Mm-hmm. You pull the meat off the leaf, right? Yeah. And that's it. It's called meat, even though it's not meat. It's just because it's just like meat. Because it's, I don't know. It's all good. It's a good way to explain they it. They just call it. Yeah, these are steamed and then grilled, guys, go, and that's that's what you're dealing I'll, with. I'll, I'll Especially go, with that sauce. I'll go put this, um, dump this to get in there a little bit. Okay. Are you ready for guys? fish, Chase? Guys, we, our fish is done. Fish so is done. This. Guys, this is what you want it to look like right here. This is rockfish, baby. It just flakes apart. That's hot. It just flakes off. Puppy's like, ooh, dinner time. White, flaky fit. Get a, fish. Get a, yeah, it literally melts in your mouth, this oh. fish. Guys. Well, that is how good this rock fish is. Oh, no, taste you don't want to test. It. You gotta be able to taste the fish still, no, right? I mean, Chase, so Chase says it's uh, good. Like, Daddy. It's not as flaky good job, as the Chase. flounder. Daddy, a lot about you. Let me see. So, guys, check out the flake. Look at that. Mm. This is. Mm, it is so good. Also, I'm, gonna butter, try, I'm gonna try it with salt this time. The, I mean, just the way it flakes. This is what I remember from 25 years ago with rockfish. <laughs> it's just beautiful fish. It, so I gotta say, Brooks did a great job cooking this. Look what is left. Guys, that is all that's left on this dish. That's gonna wrap up this Catch and Cook, guys. Appreciate you guys watching. We love it. Hit that subscribe button. Share with some friends and family who you think would love to follow us, fish and hunt, do all the fun things we do, and just be silly sometimes. So we say thank you very much. This is this is how you end it off. Oh, eating, licking the bowl clean. Yep. And we out on that.